Yep, here we go. We're en route for racing. It's gonna happen, my first uh, race. Of course, I'm with uh, Eric, my taxi driver. Now with the screen in between, because of all uh, this uh, COVID-19 stuff going on. But the first race is there. Um, we're going to Portugal, to Portimao, to do the first 24-hour uh, race with uh, Creventic. And we will drive in the same car as I will be driving at the World Touring Car Championship, my Audi in full Coronel livery. Ha! I'm so happy I can drive again. You cannot believe. Okay guys, this is uh, Schiphol, completely empty, now they're diving away, hop, boom! <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I'm not filming you guys, <laughs> he doesn't matter, but, but the ladies, <laughs> check out my new shiny suitcase, hoppa, there you go, bye bye. First time boy, there you go, <laughs> this is first ride. <laughs> To Portugal. Ah, please don't forget my helmet. Thank you. <laughs> Important this weekend. You look good, man. <laughs> hey, it doesn't work like that. You have to push it over the nose. Oh, yeah, okay. but uh, I need to breathe. Okay, uh, if you don't recognize him, uh, Jerome Blekemola, also one of the drivers, you will be driving with? Uh, I don't know yet, actually. Okay, <laughs> but, but what car? In a Porsche. Porsche. So, uh, We'll see him on track as well. And we fly together and we just spoke, we both have a rental car and we're gonna cancel one. We have to fill in some forms for healthcare. On the control? Uh, I check with you. <laughs> yeah, stay in the same place. <laughs> like it's cool. Yeah. <laughs> Arrived in the hotel. Typical uh, Portuguese uh, hotel, really nice. Here in Portimao, I drove back with uh, Jerome Blekemole. Check out this one. No, nope, no holiday, but driving a 24 hour race. Okay, good night everybody. It was a long trip, tomorrow some driving, finally. Good morning Portugal. A little bit cloudy, but a beautiful place to wake up. Arrived on track with the driver's room. It's over there. See our beds and our uh, bags. Let's go to the pit. Yep, arrived here for Timao in the pit box. You guys are uh, preparing uh, the car. It's a little bit different because of the long distance, of course. The timing uh, tire change. Mathieu is checking it. Seems like uh, reasonable fast, huh? Is he okay? Less than 20 seconds. Less than 20 seconds. Ah, oh. fine tuning. <laughs> Ready. We're making here some uh, practice cases. Looking good, 20 seconds. Hoppa. 15. 15, here. We're ready, guys. We will start now the briefing notes we have for you. In order the driver's to briefing goes digital. <laughs> nou, we staan nu uh, bij scrutineering. Tweede gekwalificeerd. Met uh, uiteraard uh, alle rijders. Maar we missen er één. Okie dokie. Well, this was the night practice. Car is still one piece, so uh, no difficulties. But uh, mamma mia, it's dark out there. Check that. There's no light. In the end of the straight, also there, completely no light. So it's uh, very, uh, very interesting. Uh, we have some extra lights uh, underneath the bumper. Completely uh, down there. But uh, whew, that's uh, going to be uh, going to be an interesting one. Uh, well, you just uh, nighttime have to get used uh, to the darkness, but uh, we'll be okay. And uh, my uh, my teammates are just uh, discussing uh, how to fit the seat belts to have a fast. Uh, Driver change, huh? Did we find out now? We're perfect. How many seconds? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, no answer. <laughs> we're in the shit. <laughs> we'll see tomorrow. <laughs> Wait to see. Okay, guys, we're now in the car, en route to the hotel. Check out there. We have our opponents hey. in the car. We bring them to the hotel. We could, we could also <laughs> drop them here in the bush. <laughs> yeah, we should. We should make a deal. <laughs> Hey, jongens, 
go back to the hotel, have a drink, and tomorrow, 24 hour race. Okay, and then uh, when we arrive in the hotel, of course, after a long day of work, the guys deserved a beer. Good night, and then uh, tomorrow uh, we will have uh, the 24 hour race. Good morning, everybody. Check out Portugal. Everybody is waking up. Absolutely nobody in the garden or swimming. At the moment, it's uh, nine o'clock. Totally up there, you can see the coastline of Portimao. Beautiful here in the Algarve. But at 12 o'clock, we will start racing. Here we are on route to the track. Yeah, yeah, with the boys. Today is going to happen, guys. The race. 24 hours. 24 hours. This is going to be a long one, huh? Eh? Starting with Tommy. Yep, I'm going to do the start. Thank you guys for that. Huh? Yeah. Why Actually, you don't start? Well, it's always good to go to experience first. <laughs> Come on. Always. always. H, H. <laughs> and the young boy with us. Very fast, very clever. Huh? Your first 24 hour? Yeah. Ah! Oi, oi, oi! So you're a virgin! <laughs> <laughs> you yes, I said. Left to me, left. This left? This left. There we are. All the parts are ready. For in case we have difficulties. Gearboxes. Still some, uh, some light. Finishing touch. Good morning, boss. All good? Yes, all good for you. Ready to fight? Yeah, I'm ready to fight. What's what's that? Uh, we need some light for puppy. Ah, puppy needs some because light. Because I didn't see anything in the dark. Yeah, you were too quick. <laughs> <laughs> it's better. Yeah. Okay. All good. All good. This is uh, how we have uh, lunch uh, at the track, just at the hospitality unit. Uh, of course, we have to wear uh, masks. But uh, not uh, while we're having uh, having lunch. Okay, guys, there we go. The 24 hour here in uh, Portimao. I will try to keep you guys updated. Keep on following us. I will do the start as you see. Later. Here we have the pit stop. Uh, now, uh, Berto is going in the car. This is how we do it. Watch it. Hoppa. Up. Getting dark outside. That's what you have at the 24 hour race, of course. The sun going down. Car is picking in. Natal is uh, now in the car. This is here. Good job. Big tires. High time. Okay, no panic. I know the race is still there. And uh, we are just uh, changing the brake pads. Normally we should have done it within eight hours. I got some difficulties. Also, we put some extra oil inside, but everything under control, still P1. Papa. Okay, as you see, I have to do uh, some work here. Thank you, Matt, as uh, our engineer. Everything seems all right. Just changing uh, the brake pads. Normally uh, every uh, eight hours, and we last a little bit longer, so we did well. Hoppa! Well, guys, I think it's uh, right that we change the brake pads, as you see. There was only metal, there was no pad left anymore, especially on that one. Look how it's grooved, it's still hot. Oh, also, the discs are completely gone. Almost finished, still uh, 10 laps to go, so some parts are still here. 
or in case something happens. But uh, to be honest, uh, this is it. Uh, we get a penalty of uh, 10 laps because we made a mistake. Uh, it's, uh, it's only allowed to, to let the pro drivers uh, drive 12 hours and amateur also 12. But uh, we only have, a, let's say, amateur one, which is, uh, which is uh, Nicholas uh, Bart. Um, yeah, and he, he only did uh, seven and the rest uh, we did. So, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's a pity. Uh, that's why we get a penalty of uh, 10 laps, uh, but which means we will still finish P2. This is where my team uh, gives us all the information which happens on track. Team boss, Francois, Mathieu, the engineer, Robin, the strategist. All the pit stop strategies. They calculate everything here in this program. And it's running well, isn't it, Robin? Yes, of course. Yep. Almost finished. Almost finished, yep. We did okay. But uh, a little bit uh, back scene of Come To You Racing. There we go, race has uh, it's been completed. Jerome, where did you finish? Uh, P3 overall. P3. Opa. And class win, although there were only two cars in the class, but uh, yeah. overall, <laughs> third was good. <laughs> uh, we finished P2, as you know now. Um, we had a penalty of uh, 10 laps, <laughs> we were still P2. So, uh, small discussions. But after tension comes relaxation, so at the moment it's very easy where we have to go. To the right. To the right. So it's very easy. We're going to the beach because we are in Portugal. Uh, tonight we will fly at 8 o'clock, so we will have a beer on the beach. Toch? Yes, for sure. Back after a nice lunch, took back the rental car and my friends. But everything very, very quiet here at the airport. And of course, again with the mask. As you see, the airport is completely empty. Nothing is open, so I'm gonna get something to drink. Hey, check out this one. Uh, who do we got there? I know these boys. Hey, they took another flight from Lissabon <laughs> with two and a half hour drive. You guys know that I had a beer on the beach, eh? <laughs> Thank you, guys. Yeah, my team is uh, from Belgium. They uh, flew by Lisbon and uh, we took Faro. So that's, uh, that's the difference. But uh, they, uh, they still have a trip of four and a half hours uh, to the south of Belgium, where is uh, the workshop. So uh, big trip still for them. There will be something like four o'clock uh, at home. Anyway, hey, that's racing. Check out. Hoppa. And who are there? Yep. My helmet and my bag. Okay guys, I'm now in a taxi with uh, the screen again with Eric and he's just telling me because it's 12.30, today is his birthday. And it's a special one because he is 50. Congratulations Eric. Hey guys, I'm home. Yep, I had a good race, long trip, but this was it, the vlog. I hope you liked it. If you want to see this more often, let me know in the comments below and uh, wait for the next one. But we'll keep on racing, don't worry. Good night.